Welcome. In front of me is a Revel 6 or Revel uh, from T-Mobile, however you pronounce it. Uh, that's the phone. But anyway, today I will show you how you can enable your power saving mode on this phone. So with that in mind, let's just start off by pulling down our notifications straight from the top, extend the list, and in here you'll find power saving mode, at least on one of the pages should be visible. So there we go. Battery saver, it is located on the second page, at least that's where it is located for me. This is the default location of the toggle. Uh, I haven't changed it, so hopefully you can find yours in the same exact place. Now once you locate it, simply tap on it. It will bring up this message, turn on battery saver. Battery saver turns on dark theme and limits or turns off background activities, some visual effects, certain features, and some network connections. So I just select turn on and you can see a red outline on your battery to signify that it is right now running. Obviously the phone right now is in dark mode, uh, but there's also a couple of things happening in the background, which uh, the little pop-up did kind of tell you that it's gonna happen, but I didn't really go into detail. So let me try to maybe give you some clarity now i will be i'll be guessing just a little bit uh, based on how usually these modes work but when you enable power saving mode for the most part it does turn off wi-fi and mobile data when the device is not being used so right now as you can see the screen timed out and the device just locked itself so at this stage it's gonna start a countdown and after whatever the countdown is maybe five minutes or so it turns off wi-fi and mobile data to preserve battery life now because of this slight change you won't be receiving any kind of notifications that would require internet connection so as an example apps like messenger facebook instagram and so on you won't be getting any kind of notifications from those applications even if someone writes to you uh, so yeah even if you know that you should be getting it you won't till you wake up the device again at which point it will connect and then uh, start syncing everything that was missing so there we go now additionally uh, sometimes it lowers down the brightness of your device and obviously turns on the dark theme and uh, uh, limits the background activity so apps that are running in the background like uh, these will be quicker terminated so they don't use use up your ram and that will also save up your battery now with all that being said all these things might uh, reduce your battery or increase the battery life when enabled uh, but truth be told one of the best ways to get better battery life would be by lowering down your phone's brightness and to do so all you need to do is pull down your toggles once more and you have this gigantic slider right here lower it down to however you feel comfortable uh, this phone doesn't get too bright so uh, that is already a little bit of a bummer but lower it down however far you can and just lowering it from like max brightness to probably halfway you should get maybe two hours of battery life more so that is something that you might be interested in um, and obviously brightness um, Editing your brightness can be done no matter if the power saving mode is enabled or not. So it's just a completely independent thing you can do. But with that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.